Hi everyone, we all know that audio recorded with an external microphone is always going to be superior to audio recorded using the internal mics on a camera. And if that external audio is recorded to a recorder that is not connected to a camera, perhaps as a standalone audio recorder, then syncing the audio later in the video editor is possible, but time consuming. Now lining up the audio files and sound waves to each other can be a little bit fiddly. Now, if this is something that you do often, like I do, then you'll be pleased to hear that Filmora by Wondershare has an exciting new feature that automatically synchronizes the audio files for you in just a few moments, and it's gonna save you a lot of time. It's fast and it's easy to use, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do it. Okay, so I'm now going to do a demonstration of the audio synchronization feature that's built into Wondershare Filmora. Now for me, um, particularly, I find this a bit of a godsend because um, synchronizing the audio is actually possible to do by hand, um, but it just takes quite a lot of time and uh, it's a bit of a little bit trial and error. So this feature is just does it in a few seconds. So it's going to save a lot of time and speed up the workflow. So how does it actually work? Well, if you actually um, have a couple of clips, so I've got a video clip here as an example, and it's got some audio attached to it, which is the audio that came from an internal camera. Let me just play that just for a moment. Then syncing the audio later in the video editor is possible, but time consuming. Okay, so that's the audio from the internal camera. And I also at the same time recorded the audio from a different microphone, a Lavier microphone, into an external um, recorder. And I want to use that audio uh, rather than the one on the camera that's attached to the video. And that's what I've got in this other clip here. So let me just play that as well. Hi everyone, we all know that audio recorded with an external microphone is all... Okay, so let's now synchronize up the two clips. So it's a case of selecting the audio clip and then selecting the video clip. Um, and then we're going to right click and go to auto synchronization. Okay, now the two audio, uh, the two clips are synchronized via the audio. Let's just play it and find out. Hi everyone, we all know that audio recorded with an external microphone. Okay, so that the clips are now synchronized. Let me just mute the one on the video track. It's always gonna be superior to audio recorded using the internal mics. So that's the sound that's coming from the external recorder. So that's now lovely and synchronized up. Now one thing to bear in mind I've noticed is that um, if you have the audio disabled on the video track, then you're not going to be able to synchronize it. Let me just show you what I mean. So if we just drag out the audio once again, um, out of synchronization and select the two tracks, right click and go to auto synchronization, you're gonna get a message saying that the selected clips can't be synchronized. So just if you get this message, just make sure you have unmuted the audio on the video track and you should then be able to synchronize up the tracks again. So there's one thing to bear in mind that certainly caught me out. The other thing to bear in mind is make sure you don't detach the audio from the video track um, because it does actually need the uh, some audio track um, in order to be able to do the synchronization. Okay, well that's pretty much it guys. That's uh, a, a demonstration of how to do the auto synchronization audio with the uh, Wondershare Femora. Okay, there you go. For me personally, this is a really useful feature and it's gonna save a whole load of time so that I can concentrate on other aspects of video editing. Well, of course, I hope this little tip is useful and if it is, hit the subscribe button for more Filmora tips like this.